Hello Internet, my name is Vince Steele and today we are back checking out the rest of the PS2 Mystery Box games. Last time we had a pretty good selection, so hopefully we have some good ones in here as well. Everything or Nothing is very promising, it's got some very good reviews, I've got some wrestling games in there, I'm a big wrestling fan, and we've got some mystery ones as well like Robot Warlords and Sky Surfer. Anyway, enough talk, let's do this. Alright, before we start, I just want to point out something about Sarge and Hutch. Uh, someone let me know in the comments that you can actually play this two player with one person with a steering wheel and another person with a uh, light gun controller which is pretty awesome and um, but it doesn't tell you that anywhere on the front of the box and then he tells you that right at the back on one little tiny line let one player drive while the other shoots use wheel and light gun control simultaneously that sounds awesome why they should put that on the front of the box or advertise it somewhere that's that's literally it and one tiny note at the bottom here that the gun control is compatible but that's it. And in the game, I didn't see anything about it either. Like, advertise that. That sounds awesome. One person on the controller or with a steering wheel, another person with a gun. How cool would that be? Yuck. Anyway. Alrighty, first up, we've got Robot Warlords. It's our friends at Midas again. Oh boy. Alright. As far as I can tell, it's just some, um, uh, I don't know, a, a game where you play as a robot. I assume you you run around shooting other robots in the big mech. Let's have a look. Yes, the manual. There's a disc. Let's go up a quick peek. Uh, yeah, that's all right. Bit of a, a line across there, but it should be okay. Let's find out. Robot right, Warlords. Push start button. I like the music. Story new game. Continue. Versus mode or config. It's story new game. Citizens of Japan, please kindly accept the current situation. In the half century since the end of the war, our system has been one of extreme and enforced labor, while politicians, bureaucrats and the like have become parasites living of our people. Now the time has come to topple the current regime, carry out radical reforms, and rise up to construct a new nation. I repeat, citizens of Japan, all right. A hotel in Tokyo. Oh god. We were lucky to get the prime minister out of there. Well, we've got actual voices, so that's something. Yes, but we were just getting the politics sorted out. That idiot. <laughs> what are the armed forces up to? So the music is way louder than the voices. It's kind of hard to hear them. Ah, the army and air force are deciding on a joint strategy. Strategy. We have absolutely no combat intelligence on our opponent. Solid voice acting. Okay, let's skip all this. Let's go to the game. First repulsed enemy guard at Shibuya Station. Within 10 turns, destroy three enemy ships. Oh, it's turn based. Okay. Alright, character. We've got Shuji Kamiyama. Kam Kamiyama. I don't names. Kasumi Janucci. Janauchi. Yozu. You'd think by now I'd know how to pronounce Japanese names. But without out of bloody JRPGs I'll play. <laughs> uh, Yuzo Tokunaga. Yoku Nakatani. Okay. Uh, team formation. Okay. Garage screen. Change bullet names. Let's see. I must recall it. Bums. Uh, yeah, that's all fine. Oh god. How do I start? Mission, okay. Now, loading. That's a uh, fancy loading screen. Any time now. Whoa! Epic. 
turn one. Okay, well, I do like turn-based games, but this is not what I was expecting at all. Um, okay. I don't spend too long playing this game <laughs> right now. It's only my first impressions, so I'll see if I can win a single fight. Uh, okay, you move there. I see, okay. Do not attack. Yes, I am. Okay, how do I... <laughs> Just go. Okay. Here we go. Wow, look at him go. Oh, he's turning. Wow, he's walking. Oh, it's so exciting. Oh, look at the action going on right now. Oh, he's taking more steps. Yeah, wow, that's so exciting. Oh, that's the enemy's turn. Whoa, there he goes. Oh, whoa, he's aiming. Is he gonna shoot? No, he's gonna. He's gonna keep walking. Whoa, he's turning. Oh, okay, that was almost too much action for me to take. Okay. Oh, it's not over. Oh, we're moving again. Whoa, he's going quickly. Whoa, okay. My heart can barely keep up. Right. Let's move the camera around. Whoa, okay. One eternity later. No. Oh, we killed something. Yeah. I attained 100 experience points. It disappeared. This is Tokunaga. I shot down one enemy craft. No, you didn't. You punched it. Turn seven. That is seven turns too many. Dark locks, I guess. Boosh. Oh, damn it. Just die. This is so boring. Oh. <laughs> it was worth it. You two. You so Tukanaga's bumps destroyed. And with that, I'm going to stop playing. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> that was the slowest and most boring turn based strategy game I've ever played. And there's nothing on here to indicate that that's what that is. It's like. Nothing. Oh, okay, turn base. It says, wait, hold on. Oh, yeah, okay, turn base control system. That's it. That one little tiny bit in this massive wall of text. It just looks like a robot called cool Robot War game. It's called Robot Warlords. And I've got nothing against turn based strategy games. I quite like them. But this, I'm so freaking slow and way too complicated for what it was. Ugh. I'm starting to think Midas is like the uh, LJN for PlayStation. LJN made terrible Nintendo games, Midas make terrible PlayStation games. Midas, more like my ass! <laughs> wow, I did not think I threw it that hard. <laughs> I think this case made entertaining or something, Jesus. Well, rip in peace. I never thought, <laughs> I never thought I'd see that. Wow. Well, nothing about it was lost. All right, this is more like it. 007, Everything or Nothing, a game with very high reviews on Metacritic. Looks really fun. They had a lot of sort of Bond games around this sort of time. And for the most part, I think, I think they were pretty good aside from a couple. It's got all the voice cast in it. It's got Piers Brosnan in, uh, the rest of them. So yeah, it looks uh, pretty damn cool. I'm gonna check it out right now.
Okay, here we go. Boom. Banana. Na -na. Oh. Maybe the mountains to Jackie's down. I didn't see what was happening. Landing zone is cleared for arrival. Double O seven. Intelligence reports that a nuclear suitcase bomb stolen from the ex-Soviet stockpile has surfaced in southern Tajikistan. Unfortunately, it's about to change hands. The wrong hands. We cannot allow this to occur. Recover the bomb and bring it back. Okie dokie. It's Piers Brosnan. Oh my goodness. Uh, basic combat. Step 1. Press R2 for wall cover. Uh, hold L1 to lock on to target. R1 to fire. Got it. Nice and simple. Already I'm impressed. Graphics look very good for a PS2 game. Yeah, I like this. This is much better than Robot Warlords. Surprising, I know. Get to that briefcase bomb. Okay, okay. Whoa. Alright, I'm just survived that, no big deal. My health barely went down at all. Oh. Whoa, got him. Choke slam. Ow. Okay, I'm gonna not go out there anymore. Go! Oh, weapon choice, okay. Shotgun. I do love a shotgun. Shotguns are cool, okay. Um, maybe not against a helicopter. Is that a rocket thing or grenade launcher, maybe? Yeah, it is. Whoa! Look at that, destructible environments. Futuristic, baby. Whoa! My health is barely going down at all. James Bond is very resilient. Yay, we got him. It is 1,000 times more exciting than Robot Warlords. This is like the complete opposite. This is a complete 180. I'm already loving this. Well done, 007. The evac helicopter is in position. Boom! Missed. Boom! Nice. Uh, escape to wall, I right, got it. Whoa! Calm down, lady. Just saying hello. So how's it going? Good? Yeah, yeah, okay. Bye. Hmm. Here we go. Whoa. What a what a That was cool. That's a very cool opening. Ooh.
That was cool. That was an awesome opening. Damn, that felt like an actual like James Bond movie opening. So freaking cool. I like this. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Yeah! Drop explosion into Ben. Back to shutting off the flame vents. Careful, careful. Okay. No, not that way. Ah, right, here we go. Shut off flames. Here we go. We're getting it. Oops. Okay, let's avoid the fire. Here we go, we made it. Drop your weapon. Uh oh. Sorry, gentlemen, but I have a train to catch. Ah. Nice. Train chase. Okay, this must be a vehicle segment. Let's do this, and then I'll and then I'll stop playing. That's invisible. Train, you must find a way to get on board. Okay. Get to the train. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Can we get in? Alright, oh, America, I forgot. Other side of the car. There we go. <laughs> okay, how do we have we drive? Okay, hold it. Drive. I'm trying to drive through the pie. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Gotta go through the pyre. Through the pipe and flames. Guys. Yeah, here we go. Boom. Oh, that's a wall. Can I blow it up? I can blow it up. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. Wee! Whoa. Oh, there we missiles. Ow. Yeah, there we go. See ya. Ha <laughs> ha. This is so cool. Whoops. That's a wall. Oh, God. Drive around it. Oh no, we can't drive around it. Oh no. Oh no, our boss didn't pounce it. Ah. Oh. I, ooh. Okay. Duh. Yeah. I am not very good, James Bond. Oh wait. This way. Ramp. Whee! I got a double of seven points. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. Get 
Whoa. Under the train, got it. Oh, well, I'm coming, coming on. Whoa. Oh, what machine gun? Okay. Catching up. I'm supposed to get underneath it. I'm not sure I had it. There we go. I might be able to get underneath it now. Whoops! That's uh, that's the that's a bridge right there. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, this time. Underneath the train. I don't know how I would get underneath the train. But we're gonna try anyway. Yeah, keep shooting it, maybe. Maybe if I'm really low, when it get when the when the uh, road dips, I'll be able to sneak underneath them. Here we go, yeah. <laughs> so what am I supposed to do? Oh, there we go. Oh, it checks me. We got it underneath it. We did it. Nice. Okay. Yay. Okay, that was really fun. <laughs> I just played this game for like an hour. You know what? Worth it. Yep, incredible. A plus. That's that was so much damn fun. That literally felt like a Bond movie, but in game form. That was so much freaking fun. D A we master this. Screw Golden Eye, we master this. This was so much fun. God damn. Yeah, A plus. Plus plus plus. So good. Yeah. Alrighty, Colin McRae Rally 04, made by Code Masters, who have been doing this for a long, long time. They are masters at racing games at this stage. They know what they're doing. They make the uh, dirt games now, dirt rally games, which are also pretty damn good. Um, yeah, looks like a rally game. Let's check it out. Let's look at the disc first, actually. Oh, I forgot to do that. I forgot to do it last one as well. Whoops. Uh, yep, ooh, looks a little scratched, but it should be alright. Let's find out. Okay, let's do a quick race. Finding now, random car, random stage. And let's do it. Let's one damage normal. That sounds good to me. Japan, Mitsubishi Lancer Evo 7 Rally Car. Okay, this looks really good. The people, not so much. The car and the environment looks really good. 60 FPS, nice. Okay, driving. Okay, I'm not very good. <laughs> the driving does feel very smooth. Okay, thank you. Yeah, the controls are good. Whoa. I am usually quite bad at like racing simulators. As you can tell by me crashing into uh, everything so far. I have no idea what is telling me. Okay, oh, think you're right. Ugh. Okay, okay, I'm getting the hang of it. It feels really good to drive. The frame rate is excellent for a PS2 game. Whoops. Spinning 60 frames a second. It looks great, and I'm not sure how they how they're putting it off on the PS2. Whoa. It's squiggly. It's squiggly road ahead. Okay. Okay. Wall, wall, wall. Just, just hug the wall. <laughs> That's one way to get around it. Oh my god. I'm so bad at this. Okay. Yep, yeah, okay. That's better. There we go. We're getting it, we're getting it. It's, it, it looks and feels so smooth. I am very impressed. I didn't, I didn't even know PS2s could run at this, you know, a higher frame rate. 
Ja. Ich hebe ihn noch. Yeah. Well, okay, we're going to go backwards. Yay! <laughs> right, let's see one more race. We're in the in the desert now, or like a uh, some woods like this, different environments. Whoa! That was one strong bush. I feel like. It's just a different road surface, it feels different, it's like slidier, which is cool, that's a lot of, well, some good detail. Tree. Yep, this is a solid game. Codemasters are very good at racing games, always have been. Even since like micro machines on the Mega Drive, <laughs> they've always been good. Wee. That was a cool slide. Yeah, this rock is definitely way slidier. I like it. Trees, bush. Oh god! Whoa! Yeah, really fun. Just, yeah, a standard uh, running game. Plays well, plays super smooth. 60 FPS, all that fun stuff. Uh, yeah, very good. Would I recommend playing this over newer running games? Probably not. That doesn't mean it's bad, it just means it's, you know, out of date. Same reason you wouldn't play like an out of date sports game. But yeah, if you collect PS2 games and you like rally driving, then yeah, give this a try. It's a lot of fun. So yeah, we'll give it a B. Yeah. Alright. Alright, revenue time, baby. Smackdown, shut your mouth. This is the uh, fifth game in the Smackdown series. Very cool. Well, I remember all the Smackdown games were a lot of fun back in the day. You know, all your favorites there. You can you can shave Kurt's angle if you want. That's a thing. Um, <laughs> yeah, let's have a look at the disc. These games are so fun back in the day. Okay, a bit, a bit spotty, but give that a clean, it should be fine. Right then, let's have a look. Oh, right, here we go. Mount Imagine time. The beautiful paper! Oh yeah, it's the best. Ah, oh, I missed the old best arena. It was so good. Bring it back. Shut your mouth. Here we go. All right, let's have a look. Let's have a look at the roster. This is one of my favorite things about look, playing old wrestling games. Just looking at the rosters. It's like a point in time in wrestling. You can see he was wrestling at a certain era. It's sometimes you find people you even forgot existed. All right, let's have a look. Here we go. The Rock, of course. Scott Two Hotties. Saw him recently at a local event in a tiny hall. It was it was awesome. Uh, Shawn Michaels, looking very young. Sean Stasiak, there you go, here's an example. Forgot you existed. Uh, Spike Dudley, Stacey Keebler, Hall of Famer. Stephanie, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Tajiri, Taz, Test. He's dead now, rest in peace. Tori Wilson, Triple H, Trish Stratus, Undertaker, Herbert. William Regal, X Pac, Al Snow, Albert, Big Show, The Big Falbowski, <laughs> that was the thing. Billy, ah, uh, from Billy and Chuck. Oh my god, legendary. <laughs> a great tag team. Billy Kidman, Booker T, Bradshaw, Barack, Lesnar, in his early days. Bubba Ray Dudley, uh, Redacted, Chris Jericho, Christian, Chuck, DDP, Devon, our Reverend Devon. That was not a good gimmick. Uh, Eddie, rest in peace. Edge, Farouk, Goldust, Hardcore Holly, Hollywood Hulk Hogan, The Hurricane, Ivory, Jazz, Jeff Harvey, Kane, Kevin Nash, Kurt Tangle, Lance Storm, Lisa, Mock, wow, look how young he looks. <laughs> Matt Hardy, Maven, Molly Holly, Randall, Keith Orton, Raven, Rhino, Ric Flair, Rico, <laughs> Uh, Rikishi, Rob, Van Dam, and we're back to the rock. Wow, huge roster. Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. Tag team match. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. Billy 
and Chuck Gorse. Uh, versus, who can we be against? We'll go against the Hardys. Matthew and Jeffrey, the Hardys. Let's play. Let's see if I can remember how to play. Good to me. <laughs> <laughs> so good. We actually played this bully in the last game, didn't we? <laughs> oh, it's Gangra versus Billy. Billy Gun, Mr. Ass. That's right. Alright, here we go. Oh, kick him when he got. Alright, we're filling out the buttons here. Neck breaker. Nice. Alright, how do I pick him up? No, not like that. Uh, oh, okay, here comes, Bi uh, here comes Chuck. You gonna help me suplex this guy? Yeah, here we go. Oh no, I'll do it myself. Oh, big jackhammer, okay. He did jackhammer in the last game as well. I guess I guess Billy, Billy did just have a jackhammer in his arsenal. I just didn't remember. Uh, here we go, doing a bit of a dance. <laughs> ah, didn't quite work. Neck breaker. Oh, a little dance. <laughs> trying to figure out what the buttons do, whoops. Down there you go. Oh, big DDT. Oh, God damn it! Whoa! Out of the ring. Spinning to the outside. Jeff getting involved now. Ow, into the steps. Oh, Jeff, not you. Is Jeff up? Wait, I'm confused. Is Jeff legal or is Matt legal? I've forgotten. I think Matt's legal, isn't he? All right, let's get back in the ring. Here we go. Oh wait, is, am I going to win by count out? Yep. <laughs> well, I win, I guess. <laughs> I'll take it. So good to me. <laughs> Man, Jeff just dead. Yep, really fun. Just how I remember it. Pretty stacked roster as well. Pretty damn cool. I like looking at old rosters of these kind of games just to see. We like capture the point in time in wrestling history. It's it's cool. I just don't think I quite like it. But yeah, it still holds up. Uh, just control the controls are a bit, you know, ancient at this point. That's yeah, you know, to be expected for these kind of games. Uh, but yeah, that's that still gets. Hmm. So I just to give it an A or a B. It is very good. You no, know I'll give this, I'll give this a B, a B plus. It's a B plus player. Smackdown vs. War, 2006, more wrestling, yeah. We've got John Cena and Batista on the front there. Two legends, Rey Mysterio, Hall of Famer. Yeah, it's more wrestling, baby. This just came out later, obviously, 2006. This is towards the end of the uh, PS2 life cycle. Uh, yep, this looks pretty good. Yeah, let's give it a play. Okay, Smackdown versus Raw. Oh, got to put in the name. Hold on. What should we call it? What should we call it? Um, bums. All right, let's have a match. Oh, dark match. Play or as or compete against a WWE title holder. Let's do it. There we go. Batista. Oh, the locks. Oh man. Uh, Batista, heavyweight champion. Uh, WWE Champion John Cena, Tag Team Champion uh, the Bray and Nissan. I do not remember that tag team at all. Uh, Rene Dupree and Robert Conway, all that. I don't remember who Robert Conway even is. Uh, Galito, uh, Redacted, Paul London, and Trish Stratus. Okay, let's have a look at the roster. One day I want to make a video where I get as many wrestling games as I can. <laughs> and, we get, and I go through all the rosters just to, just to check out the rosters. I think that'll be a fun video. I think that'd be a cool idea. Anyway, we've got Undertaker, William Regal, a locked Andre the Giant, uh, Bret Hart, British Bulldog, Hogan 80s, Hollywood Hogan. Ooh, two different Hogan's. 
Oh, 80s Hogan and regular Hogan, okay. Junkyard Dog, Mankind, The Rock is locked, harsh. Stone Cold locked, Ted DiBiase. Here we go, okay. <laughs> we got Christy Hem, uh, Joy Giovanni, do not remember her. Lisa, uh, Michelle McCool, Stacey Keebler, uh, Troy Wilson, Jewish Rouse, Batista, nice big show, well, Booker T, Carlito, Charlie Haas, Charlie Guerrero, the redacted, Chris Jericho, Chris Masters, Christian, Danny Basham, Doug Basham, God, Basham Brothers, God, uh, Eddie, rest in peace, Edge, Eugene, oh God, uh, Hiding Mike, Hurricane, Jibbles, John Cena, Kane, Debrari, Kurt Angle, Mark Jindrak, that's another one I forgot, how about this on, Orlando Jordan, uh, Paul London, Randall Keith Orton, Rene Dupree, Mysterio, Rick Flair, Rob Brown, Dam, Robert Conway, yeah, no memory of Robert Conway at all, I do not know who you are, uh, Scott Johansi, Legend, uh, Shawn Michaels, Shelty Benj, Snitsky, Spike, well, a, a more extreme Spike Dudley than the last game. I don't remember him looking like that. Uh, Stephen Richards, he's having some medical problems at the minute. Hope he gets well soon. Uh, Sylvian Greener, Greenier? No clue. Jajiri, Triple H, and back to me in a second. Okay. Nobody gun, damn it. Okay. Let's be... I feel like the roster's not as big in this game. Okay, let's be Christian. I wonder if it's got his uh, really cool theme music by now. He's got one of the best theme mu musics in wrestling. I don't know if he had it at this point though. Let's have a look. We'll go against... Um, we'll go against one of the unknowns. Let's go against Sylvian Greenia. No clue. I've no idea who he is. But, yeah. Oh, no, this, this is before he got his new theme. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, this is like a modified version of his new theme. Not as good. Does never heal. I don't remember this theme music. So, yeah, the one I'm thinking of is like a more epic version of this theme song. Yep, you just close your eyes. Cool. Okay, let's see this guy's entrance. And the opponent from Montreal, Quebec, weighing 250 pounds, Sylvain Grenier. Grenier, okay. Yeah, I've zero memory of this guy. None. Oh, okay. Uh, that's a strength. Stare down. That's a strength. Yeah, Taz. They've gotten a taste of championship fever the past few years, and uh, they want a little more. Well, they're going to get it. SmackDown champions are here. Boston's going to see the best of the best in action tonight. It's Taz. Okay, this is definitely more. A lot more uh, updated than the last game. I'm surprised how different this is actually. Again, this is quite a few years apart, I think. Shut your mouth in this. Uh oh. Slow motion. Oh. Did he just call that a neck breaker? It's a DDT, Michael. God damn. Granny yeah, he's kicking my ass. We've seen this before. He'll do whatever Ding. it takes to win and take every advantage he can. Ow, my balls. I keep it in spread to attack. One button. Grab it, Christian. Okay, that's my chance. Yay! I'm I'm doing damage. Oh, here we go. 
Here we go. Yeah, I got a leg. This capacity crowd is certainly he smells blood in the water, Cole. He's oh, we got out. for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment. No, wrong button, wrong button. Stop it, Christian. Stop taunting. Oh, I fell. Man, the reversal timing is super tight. No, referee, no, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I just cannot get it offense in. The reversal timing is so very tight. And I'm bleeding now. That's illegal. Mash. Mash burns. Wow. He destroyed me. This this guy I've never heard of completely destroyed me. Rematch. Nice reversal. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Oh, pin. One. Two. Oh, that was three. Come on, ref. I'm gonna complain. I'm gonna complain to referee. What are you doing? That's three. That was three. You, 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 you big, you big bum. Oh, we got the referee. Bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you. He's got his opponent in oh, come a on. Position. No doubt, Cole. There's the neck breaker. What a move. Oh, pin. He's going for the pin. One, two. No problem oh. getting out of that one. Boy, the. Here we go. I think he's looking to mess up his opponent. Yeah. I'm prettier. I'm prettier. Hey, if you close your eyes at night, then the truth reveal something, something, and the scars never heal. Alright. Yep, more wrestling. Very good. Uh, gameplay wise, more up to date, more um, more technical. And it just feels a little bit more polished. That being said, not all the upgrades were the best, but still a really, really fun wrestling game. Um, and yeah, again, I'm going to give that a B. Uh, I would play out today. Yeah. Alright, next up we got Buster Block. Uh, it looks like 3D Breakout. Uh, should be pretty simple. Can't imagine how they would mess this up. Oh, hold on a minute. Oh god, not again. It's Midas. Oh, in that case, no, then there'll probably be some sort of first person shooter block strategy shooter game. I don't know. <laughs> oh god. Right. Let's look at the disc. Yeah. Looks fine. Let's give it a try. All right, Midas, you got some making up to do. And it's breakout. How hard can breakout be? Even Midas can't can't mess up breakout. Oh, what? It's going to be a bloody strategy game now. A turn-based bloody visual novel strategy game based on breakout. Level one, area one, stage one. Ready. Go! Finish! Whoa, that's so exciting. Go up better than. It's the best Midas game so far. Put it that way. <laughs> Whoa, look at the balls. You have so many balls. 
Whoa, look at this going on. You see, this is this is entertaining. It's basic, but it's entertaining. The ball moves really slow, far too slow. But I mean, in fact, slow seems to be Milo's specialty. But it works, and it's you know very basic, but it, it's entertaining. I mean, it's entertaining for a little while. I mean, I wish the balls moved faster. Also, no music. Just... Just the sound of balls. Well, okay. <laughs> L1 and R1 shakes the screen. Which... Oh, it does affect the ball. Okay, it makes the ball move slightly to the left or right. Okay, that's, that's, that's pretty cool. That's something. No, I'm actually having fun. It's extremely basic, but then again, it's Breakout. And Breakout, you know, it's tried and true. It works. It was fun back in the day. It's hard to mess it up. Anyway, it's decent. We got balls! Here we go. Huh. You know what? This is okay. Well, good job, Midas. You made a game that wasn't completely terrible. Um, yeah, it turns out not even Midas can mess up Breakout. It was pretty fine. It was, it was, it was fun, what it was. The lack of music is a bit weird, but yeah, it's fine. You know, put on the podcast in the background, maybe some music. It could be a, kind of a chill, a chill time, you know? It's okay. C. C, C, C. Good job, Midas. Yarg, mateys, it's time for some Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, it's a game based on a movie, so I'm not expecting, you know, A pluses or anything, but it could be like a fun little you know, action game. We'll find out. Let's look at the disc. Sometimes movie, sometimes movie games, as simple as they are, can be a fun time. Ooh, fingerprintsy, fun. Let's check it out. All right, Pirates of the Caribbean. This one, honestly, could go either way. It's a movie-based game, which are usually not great. But, you know, it could be alright. It might be just a bit, it might be a bit of fun. Alright, oh well, okay. Let's start to view hints and mission objectives. Find the bottles to open the conspicuous chest. Okay, I can do that. Oh, where's the chest? Okay, camera controls, very sensitive. All right, just time. Circle. And circle, then X to yank it open. Or mash it, okay. Or no, hold it. Okay. There we go. Monies. Oh, the camera. Okay, I want this block. Oh, I'm going to switch between Jack and Will. Okay, interesting. Square is attack. X is okay. So X is quick attack. Square is slow. Okay. Okay. Who are you? What are you doing here? Oh, X light attack. Yep. Square but heavy. Cool. Okay. Very basic combat. <laughs> As expected. But it doesn't. You know, it doesn't need to be. Uh, not every game needs to be, like, Devil May Cry. <laughs> Alright, skull spots. Mark things that you can do stuff with, <laughs> I guess. Uh, cool. The waterfall, which means there has to be treasure behind it. That's how video games work. Uh, left unlock stick, turn. T 
attack weak objects like ropes, spines, and these lookout towers with X and square to cut them down. I want to block. I can block bullets. Oh, I'm gonna do a sweet jump. Woo! There we go. Oh, the camera. It's way too sensitive. Okay, find the crack. Is it a part of a treasure map? A single piece is hidden in each locale or his our hero's visit. Quiet! Someone Somebody watching us. Okay, I mean, yeah, it's very basic. I just realized I wasn't talking during this whole thing. Uh, yeah, it's very basic combat. You know, go to a room, splash a bunch of enemies, interact with an object, move to the next room. You know, it's, you know, it's kind of a typical movie based game. It doesn't need to be anything complicated. It was never going to be like a double or nothing. But that's fine. Sometimes, you know, not every game needs to be a 10 out of 10. Nothing is happening. Um. Hmm. Am I missing something? Ah, here we go. Another chest. Oh, here we go. That was weird. It wouldn't let me interact with it. If that was a bug or part missing something. Place a probe circle to lock sabers. Okay. And quickly press X to knee your opponent where it hurts. Nice. Boom, what the balls? Boom! Now we pause to appreciate the beginning of the raid proper. First, we will unlock the main gate. Okay, mash X. There we go. More dudes. Long enough, you dallying swine. Hey, X, X, X. All right. There it is. Skull of Tay Wakata. What's he got to smile about? I wonder. It's beautiful. Ah, it is. I expect I'll see a handsome price for it. Are we having pronoun issues? <laughs> oh. Ah. Thanks for all your help, Been bamboozled. But we won't be needing you any further. No. I want Jack Sparrow to get out of this predicament. Find out. Never. Yeah, fine, yeah. Very, very basic hack and slash gameplay. Um, but sometimes, that's all you need, you know? You watch the movie, you go rent this game from Blockbusters, spend the weekend playing it, and you'll have a fun time. Those are the days. But hey, if you're a fan of the movie, you like collecting old games, and you know, you just fancy a weekend playing a simple action game, why not? You know, you could do a lot worse. Um, yeah, I'd give it a C plus. Alright, last but not least, well, maybe a little bit least, <laughs> Sky Surfer. Uh, never heard of it, there's a man on the front. Uh, it's not made by Modus, it's made by Swing Entert at Ainment. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to expect from this. Uh, yeah, that's all I really have to say. Let's have a look at the disc. 
It's fine. Uh, Alright, let's have a look. Okay. Trust your instincts. Well, my instinct is to not play this game. But I'm going to go against them and play it anyway. Dive to air. Oh, we're playing. Okay. We're about to fly. Make a move. Circle, triangle, X. Spinning time. First try. What on earth? Get ready. Good style. Good style. Make a move. I I didn't press anything. Get ready. My God. Make a move. What the hell is happening? Triangle, square, square, circle. Oh my God. She's. <laughs> you would just instantly puke. First, get ready. I have no idea what's going on. Very good style. Triangle X, triangle square. So we just do quick time events. I'm oh, just pressing the buttons well, as they give them to me. Oh, bad. Okay. X square square X. Yep. Is this it? What's happening? Get ready. Oh, bad. I've no idea. I'm doing nothing different. Sometimes it tells me I'm doing good. Sometimes I spin around a lot. Sometimes I don't spin around as much. I have no idea what's happening. Very good. Very good. I, did, I did nothing differently, game. Triangle square X circle. Oh, bad. I, I'm pressing the buttons. What is happening? First try. Can we? Okay, I'm gonna get a best start. Can we get out of this and? It's... I have no idea what's happening. Okay. Oh god. Dive to air DTA versus mode beat balloon demonstration. Okay, let's let's dive to air. We've got Germany, America, Japan, or France. <laughs> Strange names. Uh, Japan. There you go, speed, balance. Maybe pull that one, it's like even. Uh, we'll go for easy. Dive to air. Prepare to fly. Make a move. Enjoy your balance. Um. How would I do that? How do I, how do I balance? I'm flying to the air. Um, I'm pressing every button. Nothing is happening. Oh, I was just to get the red cross in the middle. Um, my score is zero. Okay, hold on. Let's look at the manual. I'm breaking out the manual. Okay, game controls, direct the buttons, activate move. Press the appropriate four button combination. Retain R to activate move. Release parachute. Okay, that's what I was doing. I'm doing four button combinations. I'm pretty sure the opening bit was like trying to teach me how to play. But I'm pressing combinations and nothing's happening. Like mean, every button I press does nothing. Oh, here we go. Okay, I just had to get the plus in the circle the right way, I guess. Okay, circle, triangle, nope. Square, triangle, nope. No, I can't balance. Okay, X, square, square, no, X, nope. You try balance, X square square circle, nope, X square square triangle, nope, X square square X. I did a move, spinning time. Get ready. My God. Bad, okay. Ugh. X square square X. 
spinning time. Get ready. Bad. <laughs> What's happening? Open your, Open your parachute now. Boom. Go for each checkpoint balloon, then land on the land point. Good luck. Oh. Go to the next checkpoint. I'm trying to turn. I really am. Oh, here we go. Checkpoint. No, I can't. It's not. I'm holding left and it's going right. Okay, here we go. Is that a checkpoint? Okay. Hit the balloon. It's turn, damn it. Okay, here we go. I'm pressing up to turn. Oh my god. Turn right and left somehow. Okay, now I'm. Okay, nope. Uh, that's a that's a very low, low quality mountain. Oh my God. Game over. <laughs> What's happening? Okay, that was confusing and terrible. What was the point of that? Okay, let's try DTA versus mode. Time extension. Oh, it's a two-play mode. I don't have a second controller. And uh, because I don't have a second controller, I can't go back. Because you need to use the second controller to go back. So now I'm just soft locked because I don't have a second controller plugged in. Ah, <laughs> uh, beat balloon. Let's be France. What's the point of giving me a speed stat? What's the difference? They don't. Uh, is it the speed you rotate? And balance. How do you balance in midair? Nothing about this game makes sense. Oh, this is different. Go for the blue balloons. Good luck. Ready? Alright, I got it. Okay, X jumps. Square goes lower. Okay. Alright. Thanks. Time bonus. Stage two, go for the balloons. I'm sensing a pattern. Well, these controls are just like very wonky. It's very sensitive. Thanks. Yeah, excellent square, I didn't have controls. Right. Go up or go down. That's it. Where's the lost balloon? Where is it? Okay. Back at stage one. Is this is this really it? Ready. I mean, whose idea was this? Like these are the only two modes. Oh, this the two player mode, which you can't play. And the weird trick mode, which made no sense. Which will let you just put a combo and spin. And get points, and that was it. That was that was the entire mode. Oh no, it's the balloon. I'm gonna miss it. No! Time's up. Retry? No. Is that really. Is, that can't be it. This can't be the only two modes. Enter your name. 
alright. No, I don't want to save. Wait. No way. Was that was there already someone called Willy? Was there that, that was was Willy one of the default names? Was that already on there? Because like the first place was called Willy, and then I was called Willy at the bottom. There's no way that was real. There's no way there's a name. There's a guy named Willy. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that's it, and and that's it, and then demonstration. Wow. I thought snowboard race was basic. Jesus Christ. What the hell was that? That is legitimately, quite possibly, the worst game I have ever played. What even... I don't understand what this game is. You, uh, uh, so you're supposed to balance the board, push a bunch of random buttons until you find a combination that works, and then spin, and then you get points, and then that's it. And then there's a mode where you float around getting balloons. I don't understand. Why do you exist, Sky Surfer? Like swing, what are you doing? What I wonder what other games they made. That makes you never to play them. Yeah. What a what a baffling game. F. All of the F. All of the F. Get there. Didn't break. Maybe it should have done. Not very good. Oh, righty, so that is your lot. We got some really good ones in there. 007, really, really good. Wrestling games, of course, are excellent. Cosmo Crow is very good. And Sky Server was absolute garbage. Oh, and Wave at Warlords is, um, oh, whoops, yeah. So, yeah, thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the like button and subscribe for weekly videos. Big thanks for everyone who checked out the last video and believe in comments and likes. Very much appreciated. And I. We'll see you all next time. Thanks very much. Goodbye.